Hello, folks, and welcome to another Walking Dead playthrough here on Rack All the Things. As usual, I am Ross Face Punch, and I did not turn my ringer off, because that's a thing. One moment here. I apologize profusely. There we go. Now, without any further, further ado, now, if you didn't watch the last one, where we last left off was we had just fought through uh, Savannah and basically a stronghold that was held by some crazy tyrannical SOB was overran. Uh, it was called Crawford. And uh, yeah, basically we came back. We lost Clem and we've been bitten. Ugh. So yeah, we're on the hunt for Clem now. Looks like Clem's totally in no time left because we, we played around every corner. Now we're in no time left, which is episode five in this playthrough, by the way. So without any further ado, let's get right into it, shall we? Get right into the loading. I really should have set this up earlier. That's fine. Holy crap with the loading. So how are you today? Having fun? That's good. Hmm. Previously on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. I think we should look for your parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! No. No. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. I don't even know if I can ask for your help. We'll look for Clementine together. I still think Hell she's yeah. Brandon. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Clementine. So somebody's got her, and we're gonna turn. I'm assuming. I wonder if we play as somebody different in season two, because there's two seasons of this. And Clem's still on the cover of season two, so... Spoilers? Sorry. Gosh, loads, you're killing me, bro. Hmm. hate that it's tailored to how I play because I try to be as neutral as I can in real life and it doesn't really pertain in this game. Vernon, get out here. There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. <coughs> Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Tony. Who is this? It's not Vernon if that's what you're thinking. You should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Oh, no, not rather what bad. For me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't a kidnapping me. Then what is it? A rescue. What? So somebody thinks that Clem is not is isn't good with me, I'd take it. 
just told all Clementine. Coming for you. Coming for you, Claire. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. We better. He knows it. How's that dude. feeling? Okay, yeah. Fine. Don't worry about it. It wasn't a full chomp. No, it wasn't. We don't have much time. Do I live because it wasn't a full chomp? Did nobody shut that door that's right there? Lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. Um, I'm the smart one. Nothing through here. Dang. I was kind of hoping they had tunnels or something. This isn't going to help. Then why would you give me the option to look at it, you dick? So this whole place has been cleared out from the looks of it. Just some surgical supplies. Which I will probably need. I think it's some sort of spreading device. Or so. just me out just looking at it. Oh, well, we're gonna it's take like it. A car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. Yoink. And nothing behind door number three. So we're gonna have to like MacGyver our way out of here. Mm. Of course we have a spreading device. I can't get my hands in between the doors. Alright, so a good thing we grabbed that spreader. Well if he can't get his hand between the doors, yet he was able to move it right there. Really? I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Oh, uh, could you imagine if that was like, uh, if that is supposed to be like a rib spreader? Oh god, no. Don't turn, Lee. Who do we play as if we turn? I'm not controlling anything, by the way. This is freaky. Why don't we just cut our arm off? Great way to start the episode. Fuck. Is he alive? Hmm. Shit. This is bad. Fuck. Tell me more than this. Okay. <laughs> this has to be done. Sorry, pal. I gotta do it. Oh god! I'm awake! Stop! He's awake! He's still bitten! So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. Take Stop the arm. arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. Damn right. Let's do this. If there's a chance it stops you from turning, we have to take it. Hey, I'm laying right here. Sorry. It's not really our Hack call it. anymore. Take the arm. No shit. If we take off the arm, you don't die of blood loss. Well, maybe you won't die from the bite. What do you think? God damn it. Uh... We'll leave it. No. We leave it. Are you sure? Yeah, I feel like I got time. Just keep an eye on me. I get my hands on the bastard who's got Clem. I'm gonna be happy to have them both. But you're gonna die. Yeah, but not in here. You guys keep an eye on that door. I'll work on getting us out of here. Lee? No. This is what we're doing, and I don't want to hear anything else, okay? 
Did I make the wrong choice in keeping the arm? I don't know. I know those are surgical supplies that I'm not allowed to take. Surgical supplies. Did this thing get shut again? Well, that sucks. Broke our rib spreader. It's not a very good rib spreader then. All right, up we go. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make hmm. it to an empty floor or even the roof. Sounds good. Really? There's some light up there. Good. Gotta get my ass off this ladder. Kind of glad we got two arms now. The zombie's in the elevator. Scare me like that. Okay up there. Oh, you just can't, fucking peachy. You can't give me three different sentences to read. With like a half second to do a thing. Oh shit. Lee. Lee. Oh god. Are you alive? Can we just Get stop up. doing all this? stuff and maybe we should have taken the arm you have to pull yourself up come yeah, on we're good we're fine we're like super resilient good and stuff job. <laughs> good job buddy we got this. May or may not remind me of the hospital from season four. Oh no, I, that was season five. It's always season five. Yeah, climbing up that ladder ladder would have really, really sucked if we didn't have an arm. So. <laughs> no held. I guess it's supposed to be P, but it's like held. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. No, it wasn't. Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to All about Clem. We'll do whatever we have to. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I, uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. Shut up. Just lost my footing, that's all. You gotta let us know if you start feeling funny, you know? I know. It's just dizziness, that's all. I'm all good. As good as you can be. Yeah, Omid. Yeah. Good as I and can And lady, I can't remember whose who your name is. We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. That's where we came from. Got an achievement. Oh, poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. 
So in other words, he's around here. It's an extension ladder. Yeah, it is. So we can use it to get off of the roof. It's probably going to be the or he's probably going to be dead, the guy who was painting it. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Fuck that place. Did fix up our boat though. We get Clementine and get right back. Make sure she wears a life jacket, okay? Something tells me she's not going to want to. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Oh, well, why would it... Mm. Here's a way down. Yeah, if half the dead population of Georgia wouldn't wander in the streets down there. Hmm. You may raise a point. See anything? Nah, I'm just, uh... I was taking a minute, actually. Sorry. I, I yeah, because you need to take a minute. What's going on? That's just... Everything. Fuck, man. You know. I do. I can't thank you enough for what you did for Duck. I don't know how I'd be if you hadn't. Don't dwell on it. I look at where we are. Right now. And I can't imagine Cat and Duck and all this mess. Can't. No. No, I I'm sorry. We're in a fucking hurry to get off this roof. It's, it's not the time. I'm sorry. I'm okay. There's a bell tower over there. We know what those do. Yeah. Could be part of how we get through the streets. Yeah. How many you think are wandering around underneath us right now? In the hospital? Thousands. Hmm. I mean, who knows? It was full of dead before, right? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And out there? Look at that dust. Fuck, man, who knows? Some loud drugs outside. I apologize, folks. Any thoughts about anything else? Nah, I'm all right. Just needed to take a second. I'll keep an eye out over here. Sorry. I'm really glad that you needed a second. Just saying. Look at footprints. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. <laughs> she looks like she didn't really make it. So that's the door we came in at. I don't think we need to really look at that. Chris dies her that's name. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I could make it to that bell tower. I just don't know of down to that any hospital, hospital that I can think of with a bell tower. Thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with hay fever. It's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies, too, and just... Fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We look out for each other, but we sure as hell weren't going to let you go alone. Not with that time bomb chewed into your wrist. You two have been solid since day one. What's this? Day three? Four? Well, I appreciate it. Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you going to be able to hang in there? I have to. Be fine. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side so of the hospital... So we're telling everybody about the bell tower? It won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. 
That's the church across the oh, street I don't, from the mansion. I didn't, uh, Street should be just beyond that. That was an accident. <laughs> Holy crap, the... What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Huh, yeah. That could help. Actually, you know what? Just real quick. I'm gonna try a thing here. Hopefully it works. Wanted to uh, invert my gameplay because I play where up is down and down is up. So it's really hard to do it in the clinch with this shit. Hey. Hey. How's, How's leg? leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I feel like he's got a wandering eye. I think you're Clem's favorite, you know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. You get away with shit I never would. We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. When we get this fucker, we'll get out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. I'll see if we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay. Be careful, though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. My Thanks. middle name's careful. No way. It's <laughs> higher than this roof for starters. So yeah, I know. We need to get the ladder. Give me the ladder. Don't know I can just grab it before. The bells. Yeah, could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. No, I'll do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? <laughs> so we're agreed. Ah, ah, ah. That's some dry humor. Somebody gonna at least hold the ladder? Hurry. Yeah, what she said. This isn't nerve-wracking at all with how slow he's going. Oh, shit. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course. Ha, ha, ha. Eat it, Holy zombie. Holy shit, man! Are you okay? I thought Cliff yeah. would have just broken I'm right fine. off. I've used Try many to find extension another ladders. Way out of there? Many extension ladders. Never had it. Never had that happen. Locked. Shit. The exit in here's locked. Oh, I get to hang out. A few solid rings of this, and there'll be thousands down below. So that exit is locked. With no way out. I want to ding it before I find a way to get out of here. No, I guess I don't have a way to get out of here. Fuck it, ding dong.
I'm not gonna lie, I thought that was a hobo for a second. I forgot he offed himself. And then got his guts eaten. Delicious. They're coming this way! Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! Am I really gonna do that? Am I gonna... This is where I die. Probably three times. All because I can't invert my controller. Delicious. I think I have to jump. There's no way back. Hmm. You can make it. It ain't that far. It's not that far. Just a little hop. Boom. Good thing I'm gonna like pass out right now. Oh, sweet. I was able to get it. Oh, thank God. I was like, didn't know what to do for a second. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. Sweet. Got off the roof. Didn't fall to her deaths. <laughs> Not having it, buddy. Don't know if you knew this, but I'm having a bit of a bad day, zombie. Holy... Somebody stole the what fucking the fuck? boat! Probably the guys on, that got Clem. Just come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Who? Fuck. How could this happen? It's the guy on the radio, the one that's got Clem. They're gone. Holy shit. They're gone. Relax. Hey, guys. No, it wasn't the guy on the radio. Was it Vernon? It was Vernon. Fucker. No fucking way! The invalids? Their actions uh, contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make-a-wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! We'll never find them. Fuck them. Cancer, no cancer. Saint Sinner, who gives a shit? The people who knew what they were doing. Yeah, screwing us! He says he feels bad about it. Oh, I don't give Leaving a shit. Us and Clementine behind. They fucked us! I'd kill Vernon for that. Deserves it. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't. Go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Neutral. Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. We can do this in the yard. What do you think, Lee? What do we do now? Without Can't believe Vern and Jack. Well, I know the boat. you two are just gonna look out for number one. And number two. You know, yourself. It's not like that, man. Bullshit, it's not. Don't engage him, Omid. There's other shit at play, all right. What, you got the boat hidden He's somewhere? He's got a kid. Shut up, dude. Watch your mouth. Get to the countryside. We dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Yeah. We gotta get out into some open spaces. You know that's what I'm for. This is bullshit. You might not even be around, so... With all due respect, Lee, his opinion doesn't carry a lot of weight. Hey, it's still his little girl out there. She's number one. That's the end of that, okay? But what about... That's a fucking... Oh, shit! Room. Here they come! In the house! A lot of zombies. 
They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Here's open. We can secure this place. Krista. Get on the windows in the front room. Check the boards. Got it. Kimmy. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Omi! What is it? Everyone, help Omi now! Am I kicking it? Technically, I'm kicking this under my own foot, or am I not? Oh no, his hand was out there. That's... Please, help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! That'll work. Take their goddamn arms off! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, Again, with the lack of inversion. For another arm? Oh, there's fingers. That was so close. Now what? So close. Not a fan. This is a big, sturdy house. It'll hold. Yeah, I think so too. I was wrong. Shit. Get upstairs. Go. Guys, help me with this. Okay, I don't have control of my character yet. Damn it, Lee. Pretty heavy desk. Pretty heavy desk. Take a fucking stand. Can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Y'all know where to aim. Get back. Can I just use my 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 meat cleaver instead. I've no way, I'm out. I'm out. Me too. Fuck. Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening. Up. Out the window. I'm surprised we didn't push that desk, like, on the stairs. Oh, I dropped my gun. Oh, well, we're safe. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Chief. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the <laughs> Third. Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. Whoa. I'm sorry. Troubles in paradise? So, no ideas then. There's got to be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. Whoa, Lee, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm great. Let's go take a nap. Just... Yeah, it's am good. I just need a nap. She's with her parents? Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. What did that mean? She's at the hotel. Where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. 
What do you Shut mean? Shut up, Kenny. How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Like I said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it. We're trapped in here. How long you think we have? What? I... I don't know. You should have cut it off. At least then there would have been a chance. Well, you didn't. And it's too late now. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. What if it was you, and it was Duck out there? Whoa there, friend. I bet you'd rather stay focused on the problem, and not have people turn on you. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! Hmm. We will get Clementine back, with or without you, because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. Then kill me, you son of a bitch, okay? Don't even fucking hesitate! I will! Ah! Uh. You no. ruined that dude's face. <laughs> you ruined that dude's face. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30 foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. How's it going, Turbice? I'll be damned. We're not. I think I've seen you in the stream before. What's new and exciting? This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? That is yeah. one sturdy cut rack. Okay. Sturdy as fuck cut rack. Shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. <laughs> Thanks, Kenny. I wasn't gonna hurt you. Sure, pal. I know. This sucks. This is where we found that small little starving dead boy. Zombie. Dead zombie boy. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. <laughs> if you were me, you'd be a foot taller. Hey. And about Thanks, Trubice. Uh, I'm going to try to do this all on my lonesome. I've done it so far that way, but feel free to fight you right here, buddy. Feel free to shoot the shit and all that fun stuff. Wish you would have taken it off. I prefer no spoilers, if you wouldn't mind. I'm losing a lot of feeling in it. Really? Yeah, it's hot, like when you break a bone. But tingly, like it's asleep. Maybe I should have cut my arm off. What do you think? We just get from the time. That's the focus. Despite how I feel, I, I, I can't let vengeance be the thing. Sure. But if it's not that easy. Oh, I want to kill him. I'll do whatever it takes. I want to kill him and you know, Vernon. Whatever happens to you. Uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? I swear, she's got to be pregnant. At the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I'm bitten, Krista. We all know that. Appreciate that, Trubice. There's got to be something. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not doing this right now, Krista. Listen to him. You know, compared to it's what I want, Kenny, who's just gonna get her killed, right. in my opinion. I'm out of gas. 
You look good and rested. Sure, if you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Appreciate that, Trebais. I'm glad that we don't do spoilers here. I hate spoilers. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. Well, as much as anyone. It'll be all right, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Uh, you're gonna hit the booze again, Kenny? Does Scott tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. I bet anyway, she's gonna peek up in this episode. Uh, make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. <laughs> It's all water under the bridge. I was thinking about going with eh. can do is move forward. I can drink? Well, cheers. Sure. Don't know if he wanted to really do that, because I may just get them all infected with my, my, my saliva. Knew she's pregnant. No. She's trying to abort the baby. I'm through. No walkers. Things are looking up. That's not good. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. Maybe I don't want her looking after Clem. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well. Uh. So you guys off to yourselves. Where the fuck was your son when all that happened? You let him just starve to death. You guys are dicks. Ooh, we got a gun though. It's what Katya did. Oops, shouldn't have said that. You did everything you could. No, Lee. She left me. A son. People that cared about us. I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. So let's figure a way out of here. Look, that's the that only like girl. half sense that he's made move. this entire time. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. So I can just look at the dead bodies again. Same Lee, thing. You okay? Yeah. Yeah. Let's keep at it. He's just dead. Nothing crazy. I'm gonna look at this. I'm glad he just says stupid shit. What do you call this thing? Art? Hmm. Let's talk to Omid. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. Wow. You're just a ray of sunshine. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. Judging by the decor of this room, I guess they were PBS watchers. Hey, <laughs> my parents' house looked a lot like this. 
and they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. I don't want to open that door. I feel like they're going to be there. The streets are full. Hundreds of them. The streets are full with hundreds. Uh, I don't want to go through the house because we know the house is fucking packed. So we're going to check this one, I guess. We're going to open it. Go rooftop to rooftop, maybe? Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. If I want help, I go to the door. What do you mean by if I want help? Well, I can't actually get away now. So I guess I've been locked into this decision. Like, I just... Oh, if I want help from you, because you went to the door. Gotcha. There we go. Ooh. If you end up sticking around for the whole thing there, Trebice, I wouldn't mind finding out what happens if uh, I had gone through the door. Like, what happened differently, because I'll admit, like, that sort of thing is... I'm kind of intrigued by Oh shit. Let's keep going. Be careful up here. It was so close. And you almost died, Kenny. Right? Yeah, it wouldn't let me get back out of that thing after I opened that door. I tried to back up, but nope. It's good to be moving. You're doing good. I'm not, but I'm trying, man. I'm looking pretty fucking pale. Honestly, you know how many nights Cat and I laid in that broke-down RV? And she'd give me hell for not thinking enough about the rest of you. All of them. Every damn night. You got that walkie-talkie? Yeah, of course I do. You might want to give him a call and tell him we're coming for him. Yeah, right. Don't want to do that. Careful cross here. Uh, maybe a little later. Uh, I just want to make sure that it doesn't match up right now. <coughs> but if you end up having to go, definitely let me know because I'll... I wouldn't mind hearing from it definitely before you head out. I don't know why it's, like, making me walk this. It's like, I'm sorry. Well, I guess there's people that might actually... Be scared of heights, so you get a little bit of vertigo from the video game, maybe? Nope. I don't know. Maw of darkness full of walkers? Fuck that shit. I don't see any down there. You can hear them, right? We're all desensitized to it, but I can still smell them. Let's keep going, you bunch of lollygaggers. <clears throat> You're a dick. So sorry. We have to get it back. That's our lifeline to her. But we can find this guy without it. And what if we don't? We need every clue that comes out of it. Lee is right. I am so fucking sorry. It's fine. We just need to figure out who's going down there. I will go. No! Krista! Krista! Jesus fucking Christ! I got it. Get me up. Fuck, we can't reach. Find something, fast. Oh god. Fast would be good. Keep a fucking eye on her. I'm so glad that you're a fucking rational individual that doesn't think of this pole. Grab onto this, we'll pull you up. Good, thanks. Oh shit, strength test. <gasps> What the fuck? Didn't I do it? 
Well, at least she has a weapon now. Shit, they're in there! Fuck! <laughs> Jump up here, baby! Let's go! Jump. Oh god, no. Oh god, no. Me and my fucking mouth. Oh shit, Kenny! What are you doing? Get her, Ken! Can't you said all that shit. And not do something now. Come on, reach! I got you, hun! Save her! Go, go, go! Do you fucking hear me? Cannon, no! Oh shit, 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 Oh god, there's so much! Uh, oh fuck, I Get hate this shit. Where are you? Oh god, no. Sounds like he's being ripped apart. Where, where'd he go? Maybe, maybe he ran. Maybe, maybe the man's all right. Maybe he'll find us. What if he doesn't? He did you guys, did you. you guys at least grab I the walkie-talkie? He... Well, it was your own dumb fault, Krista. Dumb, dumb, Krista. Oh, he's okay. Oh, uh, so I just got a achievement that says sacrifices were made. So, knowing my luck, that's just he's dead. Marshall Hotel is around the corner of the block. Are you okay? Do you want to talk? Shut up! I'm good! Kenny was my friend. Soon as someone dies, they don't immediately have to have their sins forgiven. Well, it gets an hour moratorium, at least. I understand. This is a shitty time, but I want to make sure we're clear before we go forward. What is it? Now with Kenny, gone, means... Omid and I have to stay safe. For her. You guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. I'm getting really you pale, like I'm noticing you know that. that. What's going on with you? I don't know what you mean. Well, you're pregnant. Oh, I was in trouble. Sure. We have to cross here. Well, Did you end up keeping the arm there, Trebice, or no? Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg, and you're walking for two. I'm I don't know if doing so the stream's really laggy, or it's like all you have to do here is. Walk to the walker after you fall. Not a spoiler. I'll go first, clearly. Go first. Jason, you didn't cut the arm off? All right, yeah, me neither. You sure? Yeah. Hmm. I hate how the fact that like everything's just like falls just go apart. Nice and slow. It's like oh, the zombie apocalypse happens and nothing can stand up to anything. Oh, you told them to cut your arm off and they still didn't cut your arm off. So regardless, Almost I there. would not it's have lost my crossing. arm, I guess. Good. Cause I said I'd rather keep my arm, to be honest. Oh, Jesus! Shit. Oh, 
fuck! Uh. Shit! Are you okay? Fine. I'm kind of fucked here. What are you gonna do? Fuck it. I'm going for it. Going for it? What does that mean? I don't know. It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? Find a boat. We'll meet north of town. A boat? We still have to get out of the city. I told them I'll I was bitten as well. And meet you. What if? Don't what if? And I said that I didn't I'll want them to you. cut my arm off. I don't like this. Oh, you told him you were you were bitten. Okay, I see what it means now. Sorry. Do a little hacky slashy stabby stab. Boom! Oh, I get to choose what I kill him with. Such a badass. Thank God I'm not having one of my moments. Oh god no! Let's get bit again. Totally just got bit again. Fucking it's not being able to play convert uh inverted is just pissing me off. Awesome. Oh my god, that's the fucking uh I think that's the uh same station wagon from the second episode, the end of the second episode that we like jacked all their shit from that I said that I didn't want to do. Just saying. I tell you, the gamer score for this is rich. It's like 20 gamer score every like 8 to 10 minutes. It's so quiet in here. Now listen. Or is it a zombie? Well, there's a string. Let's go check the rest of the room first, maybe? I know it's just telling me to look at that fucking door. Oh shit! Adjoining rooms. Where is she? I already told you she's fine. You look horrible. <laughs> Go over there. I don't like that voice actor so far. Put your things down. Let me out. Who's out there? Oh, shit. Quiet, please, sweetie. 
your things there. I don't like this guy. This is all I've got. Okay. You travel light. I don't believe you. Oops. Double lie. That's everything. Go ahead and search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. <laughs> so we still got our fucking baby machete. Our meat do cleaver. You know who I am? No idea. Yes, I do. Yeah. I know who you are. You sell my car out front then. You see anything else you want in there? Not a whole lot left. I didn't take from you. Your people didn't? I didn't agree with it. That's what Clementine said. Why didn't you? It wasn't right. It wasn't our stuff. That's real good of you. Look, what do you want me to say? I don't want you to say anything. I want <laughs> you to know what happened. This is going to be super sad. Have uh. you ever hurt somebody you care about? Not on purpose. If it were on purpose, you'd be a sociopath. I hurt her so bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, you are a monster. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I sure. hurt her so bad. And then we came back and all our stuff was gone. Your people, Lee. That asshole in the ball cap. His stupid fucking wife. I could have earned her trust back if they hadn't made our situation so desperate. If it helps, he's probably dead. <laughs> you fucked up. I'm gonna... Sorry. I'm gonna sympathize. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later. Wow. On the road. Do I look like a monster to you? Kind of, yeah. We all, we all do. Some more than others. I'm not like you. You walked a little girl into a dairy full of sick people and let them get their hands on her. It's more complicated than that. You let a boy get yanked out of a window and into the night so you could protect a pretty girl with a gun. It was impossible to save him, to save them both. You brought her to the most dangerous place in this city where she could have died. I couldn't leave her at the house alone. She would have been better off. That doesn't like me. It's just, How it's just, you know all this? Say that now. He doesn't like me. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm gonna hurt you so bad. It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I found Clementine on my radio, I wasn't even mad at you. I was coming for the others, for revenge. 
But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lead, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I just don't like him. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. Oh, shit. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. No. no. Shut up. It makes sense. It's not happening. You'll have to kill me. Yeah. I know. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... I'm glad too. Get the wife's head. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <coughs> oh! Oh, no. <gasps> Missed it. Yep, that happened. Mm, again, because I can't play inverted. It sucks so bad. Hey, honey. I gotta go through the whole I thing think again? This is all gonna work out. What are you. It's funny, I was watching a buddy of mine play um, I'm glad to. the Tales from the Borderland Telltale game, and you can change the look inversion. I wish it wouldn't have had to be so bad. Super nice. It's all over, hon. Oh, she can also grab the. Uh, Just about. The lamp, but I'm I assuming the lamp would have a cord that might make a noise. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you <coughs> so much, Tess. You're gonna like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. You she are fucking fly. nuts, dude. Oh, uh, big strap. Mm. I chose not to gank him, by the way. I chose to punch his ass. Fuck, God damn it. Damn it. Did it again. Am I not dead? Oh, fuck. This is a big one. Son of a bitch. Come on. Am I really going to strangle him out in front of Clementine? While I've been shot in the gut. Oh, maybe not. Son of a bitch! Just go away! I will Die. kill you, random it. Clem! Shot him in the face! I feel so bad. FYI, I might eat you now because I might be a zombie. It's okay. How old were you when it's you killed okay. your first man, Glam? I, I was this many. You look horrible. <laughs> Thanks. He said. Let's just get somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm covered in Debbie blood. Clementine, we don't have much time. Okay. I'm sorry, Lee. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay, sweetie. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Does he only have one bullet in that gun? Oh, I'm getting picking up the gun. Sweet. Good shot, though, Clem. Hey. 
weren't afraid. I was. You didn't act like it. I know. I am now. It's okay. Look at stranger. Nameless stranger. I feel bad for the guy. Don't get me wrong, but he's also a little fucking nuts. Okay, so I literally just looked at him. Alright, so. Yeah, let's take a look at probably the head that's in the bowling bag. Can I like off it? You know, give a little bit of mercy? No. Leads to the other hall. There's nothing in there. Can we go? Yeah, of course. Probably should have listened first. Oh god, am I like that close to being a zombie that he doesn't consider me a threat? The guy only had one bullet or two bullets, I guess. It it didn't bite you. Yeah. I know it. Must have You're covered in all that gross stuff. I had to get through a bunch of them to get here. That's totally the reason. Oh god, am I gonna have to cover her in gross That's how we'll get out of Savannah. goop? Oh, great. You're gonna be covered in goop. Smell horrible. Which means you have to, too. Yuck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yuck. I feel so oh, no. dirty. What am I pulling out of him? Oh yeah, here, just take his intestines. This is just totally normal. I'm so sorry. It sounded like she shivered like she was cold. We'll get you cleaned up as soon as we can. Not soon enough. Shut up. You'll be safe. Are you done? A little more. I want to be sure. Just a little more. It's so gross. Yeah, it's not ungross. Just don't get it in your mouth. Or open wounds. Or your eyes, I'm assuming. She, lo so. she looks so fucking happy right now. Missing something. I thought it was gone. I thought you were gone. Weep. Thank you. Weep. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Uh, yep, there's another 20G. What's in the bag? Confronted a stranger. <laughs> uh. Really? This is, this, we just have to walk? And I can't even like strafe, I have to just go completely straight. That's cool. Sorry, I normally play shooters, so it's really weird that I have very minimal control of my character. And what control I do have usually sucks. And my cat's meowing. This guy, I don't like the look of you. Yeah, you dick. Oh, this guy over here, I don't like him either. That guy's giant! Of course you turn my way. You guys spin in a circle?
It's her mom and dad. No. Are you serious right now? Wrong time for this to happen. Could not have happened at a worse time. We get it. Her parents are fucking zombies. There's another 20 gamer score. Made it out, Please, but... Wake up. Thank God she's alive. Please don't be dead. Please, no. How'd you get me, me in here? I'm looking I'm pretty so zombie scared. right now. I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. They're dead. They really are. Uh, I'm done. We have to get out of here as fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll no, 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 that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it! Because you're about to be locked in here with a fucking zombie. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. How could she pull my, like, six-plus-foot manness in to this thing? This is like much sad many wow right now. Like I'm or many woe. Friggin' like couple episodes back, I totally teared up I just saying. I think there might be a way out over there. That guy's got a gun. Good, good girl. Let's go. I might be a little slow. <laughs> I'll help you. Feels so bad that we're gonna be leaving Clem alone. She just finds out her. I got you. Find out her parents are dead. To. I'm totally okay. turning. I'm okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. You couldn't have known. I should have told you. It was scary at the hotel. Yeah. Keep going. We're almost there. Such a brave little trooper, Clam. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. Oh, really? Another one of these? It'd be nice if it gave you like a warning before it got in. <gasps> nah, fuck. I can't. You have to. Liam, I can't move. This is it for me here. Please. Please, try to get up! Like, I'm going so nuts on this, but it literally will not let me. It's bullshit. I can't. You don't have much time. You gotta do something. Maybe I should have cut my arm off. Like what? You need to get out of here as soon as you can. I, I can't leave you. Just work on getting out, okay? We'll figure it all out. Don't worry. The way out's through there, Clem. I know. Just start by getting that door open. It's locked. 
It's no big deal. It's just a glass window. Ow! Not with your hand. With this. Okay, not with that. With the stool? There's a chair over there. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. Gotta love that. Oh, this is a jewelry store, but we have a baseball bat for security purposes. Plus a very elderly man. There's a chair over there. Yeah, it's a fucking... Use the bat to shut that window so you can reach in, okay? Okay. Watch out for broken glass. Where'd she put the bat? I wasn't paying attention. You're afraid of him, honey. You're smart. He is it. You're smarter than all of them. Grab the chair, Clint. Use it to reach in to the lock. Get you in there. Don't worry. You're doing oh. good. Then open it. He's, he's trapped. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. There's keys. And a gun. You're gonna need both of those. Hmm. There are handcuffs on the ground. Get them. Okay, me. Cuff me. Cuff me to the radiator. Put the handcuffs on me. Attach me to this. But what? Why? No matter what happens, I'm safe then. Uh, I don't know. Just do it, sweetie. Make sure they're tight. I don't. I don't want to do this. You have to. It'll keep you safe. Before we have to deal with the other. Hmm. He's trapped over there. If you're careful, you can get what you need from him. The keys. And then the gun. Yeah. The keys and the gun. Just don't Use be the, afraid. Use the baseball don't bat and cave his head in. Us. You're faster than he is. What should I get first? The gun. Get the gun, Clem. Always the gun. And I'm handcuffed. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Watch out. Holy shit, this is... Oh. Put my other arm. Yeah, Clem. Gave his dirty old head in. Starting to feel like I should have ha got myself handcuffed. I did it. I got him. Yeah, you did. I'm about to die and I know it. This is so sad. She gonna 
Is she gonna put, put one between my fucking eyes right now? <laughs> You're strong, Clip. Gotta build her up here. You can do anything. But I'm little. So? That mean nothing. You go see bad stuff, but it's okay. My parents. It's so horrible. Uh, I can't imagine sweet pea. And now you please please don't be one of them. Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. You know that. I don't know if I can. Oh god no. Mm. It's a hell of a choice. Don't make me just leave me. Leave me. It's okay. You'll be just like them. It's okay. It won't be me. Please. It's time to go. You gotta get out of here. Y you can come with me. No, honey. I can't. It's okay. Please. Have to go now. Maybe, maybe, maybe I shouldn't let you turn. I don't want you to have to do that. Shooting things it changes you, sweetie. I don't want you to get used to it. And Megan, the first days we met, do you remember? Yeah. I do. When I went out to rescue that boy, Glenn, we met a girl. She'd been bitten too. All she wanted was to come back as a walker. I couldn't bring myself to give her the gun. I didn't want to see death then, and I know we've seen so much of it, but you shouldn't have to see it now. I'll go. I'll, I'll leave you. So I'll go sad. as fast as I can. Uh, safe don't. As you can. Don't. Always be safe. Nope. <sighs> Find Omid and Krista. They're looking for a boat. Find them. They'll take good care of you. Stay away from the cities. Definitely. They're just not worth the risk. And also... Oh, no. I think I've died. I have dead. What? What is it? I'm getting misty here, man. Oh, don't know. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. Oh. Video games aren't supposed to make you cry. Still breathing. Maybe he just might not turn, I don't know. Clem, go. Wow. 
that really the fucking end of this one? That's the end? Oh. <laughs> that was not fun at all. The whole thing was just like, hey, let's see how sad we can make face punch. So 37% didn't remove his arm. Uh, 65% lost the temper with Kenny, like I did. Me and 80% kept my weapons. You're fucking right. You and 65% of players didn't kill the stranger. Mm. You and 39% of players told Clementine to leave Lee. Who the fuck else told him Lee? Ah, hello, Twitch Gabber 5000. What's new and exciting? Uh, yeah, F it was fun. Yeah, I I cried a little bit. Not a fan of that. Ay, ay, ay. <sighs> yep. That was a thing. I'm not a fan of that. Okay, so yeah, I dropped Benov. I trusted her with my past. I saved her life at the cost of another. She was killed by Lily because Lily's a dink. You defended her against Lily's accusations. I helped her get onto the train. I revealed my bite to her. Told her and Omid to get a boat and meet you. You asked her to take care of Clementine, which I feel is a good thing. Oh, this is your first time. This is your first time seeing me. Thank you. Well, I'm glad that. Well, I hope you're enjoying it so far. I don't know how long you've been around. Told him he was a strange guy, and I wasn't wrong. You were with him when you found your brother. He died when walkers attacked the drugstore. Oh, duck. Oh, poor duck. You helped uh, You helped save his life at Herschel's farm. You argued that he was not bitten back at Macon. You shot him before he could turn. You let him be your sidekick. Solve a mystery. That's totally true. He was, he was a Robin. We had this big moment where we were like... Ah, we bonded. There was a bonding moment. And then I had to shoot him all in the same episode. And really, I don't care about Ben. Ben, fuck you. I'm glad you died. Ben was the guy on the far left, by the way. Oh, you did, you've only been here for two minutes? Uh, uh, well, guys, hopefully end up sticking around. Hit that follow button. And if you go over to the info page, we have a YouTube channel as well. Me and a couple of buddies. Not a lot of gameplay up on the channel, but I will be uploading this footage. But feel free to uh, check out some of our really funny, nerdy shorts that we do. Uh, there's a couple where my buddy's dressed as a girl. I've been dressed as a girl a couple of times. I do not make a very pretty woman. Nor does he, though, because he's got a big, bushy beard. But either way, yeah. Um, and we all usually stream on here and whatnot, but I've been doing these playthroughs of the Walking Dead Telltale games because... Uh, admittedly so, like I said, I'm normally, uh, I normally play first person shooters, uh, and I've been trying to expand my horizons and these telltale games are actually really fun. Uh, I don't like how permanent your decisions are by any means, because to be honest, uh, yeah, uh, I have a hard enough time making tough choices in my real life, let alone game. So, yeah. Oh, you are following. Thank you very much, Twitch Gabber 5000. I highly appreciate that. Uh, I'll just hit A to continue. Oh, there's more. Oh, shit. So, I defended his son in the drugstore. I killed his son so he didn't have to. He was lost to the herd trying to save Krista. Oh, by the way, uh, Twitch Gabber, if you haven't played this game at all, you. This is a bunch of spoilers. Yeah, I know there's a season two. Yeah, I have. Uh, I actually have season two. You found water for Duck when he needed it. You, she shot her son and faced her son's death. You tried to revive him with CPR. Larry died in the meat locker at the dairy. Well, Larry was a bit of a dick. You backed her when the flies were missing. Lily stole the RV and was never seen again.